And if I split, we're back. Today's challenge is the culmination of a highly contentious rivalry between two up-and-coming talents. Both contestants have traveled far and fought hard for their place in this tournament. But only one may continue. We don't have any losses. Shouldn't... I mean, I know in the game we have to win every battle, but... According to the in-world lore, shouldn't we still continue even if we didn't prevail here? Today's challenger should count himself warmed. The iron stomach's blades are at the ready. Wait, did I equip the mana thing? Mina. I think I did. A brash new challenger who has a bone to pick with the notorious iron stomach. I give you wise, the righteous fury. You won't last another day here. Wise. Not much is known about this judge, except that he appears to help those in need. The people of Victusia raise their glasses to Kevin the Generous. Sup? <laughs> I'm here to try a dish with lots of fire and fur. All right. <laughs> proud to present the fierce and noble warrior, Vivian the Vagrant. Thank you, Chairman. I look forward to the battle between these two strong chefs. Strength is a duality. Warriors combine mind and body to achieve victory. Knowing this, you must present me a dish worthy of a warrior. Equal parts water and fire. And I believe it's the earth starting ingredient that I kept, not fire. We need a lot of fire. divined metaphysical truths from the stars in a faraway tower. She rejected modern comforts to live encased in a realm of endless night. Not much is known about her, save that she favored a rather unusual carrier foe. For what creature could withstand that brutal darkness except... Scowl! Okay. Bird, red chest, black body. Scowl battle. Start. Okay, the Ambrosia Vial only hits a single gem. So is it actually better than... I have a lot of mana. Okay, I must have picked up the thing. Yeah, is it actually better when you have the Stoics Pan than... Ooh. Sauces that I could use. Why am I killing this thing? Yep. All right, I have a lot of ingredients. Let's deliver them. But we need to find the theme ingredient. They're probably like at the top being a bird. Or wait, did I see one there? All right, it's one. We'll defeat more later. Let's see, so. We didn't get a fire sauce, unfortunately. I didn't also start this pan. Double, unfortunately. Oh, scowl feet are amazing for fire. Actually... I'm playing this a little weird, not actually doing my cooking and then running out, but... I want to go for the combo thing. Oh, I fell off the map. Where? Where are these birds? Oh, there's another.
Right. Isn't there some sort of like backstab skill that I forget exists? Oh, <laughs> goodbye ingredient. Whatever, we better get cooking. Let's see. Eh, whatever. That one can just stay. Yes. Cool. Uh... Ah, my combo broke. Let's see. And I destroyed a bunch of fire in doing that, didn't I? I was just looking for anything to keep the combo going. But it was a probably a at least somewhat foolish move. Let's see. I do have another thing with poison in it at least. To keep that going. Uh I would really like to hit fire with that blue effect. Oh, it promoted twice. That's pretty good. Uh, I was going to say maybe this can be the earth water dish, but uh, that's not a thing we're even supposed to aim for. I think I've just totally blown the theme elements. I bet you guilted the other chefs in the losing with your wide-eyed farm girl shit. Pathetic. Not as wide as your eyes are gonna be when the judges taste my dish. Er. Right. I'm running out of stuff. I don't know, actually, we haven't really completely blown the elements. If I just double promote this one fire thing. Of course, no need to use my sauce now. Let's see, these tails are small ingredients that have fire in them, right? No, they had poison and earth. Okay, what else? is around here. Oh, I think it was the fruit. <laughs> As I scatter it everywhere. Also, I haven't actually added scowl to the middle dish yet. So we're still trying to get fire into this dish. Uh, we're also like totally out of space. Um, let's see, I'm gonna move the level threes to the bottom. Yeah, okay, yeah, nothing combines here. If I... If I sauce this... I can at least combine blue. I don't really want another level 3 blue, even though I could make it here. Eh, let's do it anyway. Actually, everything in that dish is level... Um, level 3, except those red. So as long as both of them promote in time... I don't have space to do what I wanted. 
I was trying to think of how I could actually get four greens lined up in order to uh, move it over the stoic pan, but it's just not happening. Yeah, um... Let's see, I'm probably gonna have to Ambrosia the top one here. We can throw another Ambrosia in here arbitrarily. It won't actually help us... Um... Uh -oh. With our elements. Okay, so the dish on the left actually meets the... No, it doesn't meet the Earth Fire. So it doesn't matter which I serve these two. I, uh, forgot that once I had enough fire, I needed the earth to match it. <laughs> Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. Ugh, my taste buds. Well, it looks like he didn't get it right. The earth and fire were supposed to shine together. Or you didn't use equal parts fire and earth. You know, poison's not as bad as everyone says. Still gotta dock your points, though. Okay. Righteous. So I also didn't get the element. But it's delicious. So I believe we're ahead 30 points at this point. Grave dishonor. That, again, doesn't look like it met anything other than mono fire. And, uh, yeah. If this is an attempt on their life, we can settle it with steel. That is definitely not equal parts fire and water. But it is the masterwork dish anyway. So I'm getting away with it for now. I feel like there are going to be battles where I really need the elements. Because my dishes are filling up with level 3 gems, and there's just going to be a points cap where you can't go any higher. Once you have 16 level 4s. Wait, yeah. 400 points is just the absolute max you could get to with it. I mean, that's 400 points per dish, which would still be absurd, but realistically, at the end, you're not going to be able to effectively add ingredients and combine your gems, probably. Well, madam, I've lost fair and square. Yeah, you did. Weiss, it was a good match. I hope you know I never meant to hurt anyone. <laughs> I was just impatient. <laughs> Maybe you can start wearing a hat in case of bird danger from above. Huh. That's the least of my problems now. Was that your last loss? I guess I'll have to try again next year. Okay, so he had three other losses he didn't mention? Uh, do you mean this was your last strike? I have six wins. I waited to challenge you as my last victory to make it into the finals. But ah. is, I also had four losses. Everything was on the line for this battle. You may be knocked out. But you're not knocked down. You're a great chef, Weiss. And you better try out again. Maybe if you hadn't poisoned the judges. As much as I hate to admit it, you gave me the drive to make it this far. For that, I'm great. Actually, how far ahead of him was I? Would he have won if there just wasn't poison there? Was it just a 40 point spread? So you'll never forget me. <laughs> why is this autographed headshot? When you're feeling down, <laughs> Weiss can turn it around. Prevents knockout wants. That seems bad. See you around someday. How many tournament wins do we have? It must be like six now, right? Thanks for coming. It was a favor to Mina. Now let's see this evidence. <laughs> to the point as usual. I agree though. What did you find? This. Even at the desk of one Grandmaster Rixel. Who's plans to he? Samples from the dark realm. Samples from what? I'm not sure. Most of these notes are scribbles. Turn the page. He injected monster cells with the samples he found there. And that isn't all. His drawings are identical to the mutated cells I've been studying. Mm-hmm. So this man, Rixel, did start the outbreak. I don't think the brigade would sign off on something like that. He's got to be hiding it from them. Ziggy, you were right. Don't look so surprised. We need to tell Razzle. No. 
Kieran? I'm sorry, but we can't. You remember how she handled your expulsion. We don't know how many brigadiers are involved in this. Her reverence for the rules could put Rixel's findings in untrustworthy hands. Though I detest the methodology by which we acquired this information, we can't ignore it now. Mm-hmm. Right on, Diamonds. Kieran's right, but Razzle's already investigating the break-in. If we're going to solve this ourselves, we have to be careful. We should go about our normal lives and finish up the tournament. Maybe let this rest for a few days. Sure. But won't that give the mutation more time to spread? The Brigade's got the outbreak under control for now, but they need us to put an end to it. We aren't much good to Victuja if we're under investigation. Then it's settled. We'll go about our normal lives until we're in the Brigade. A Brigadier's life isn't really for me, but I'll keep myself busy. Okay. Good luck, everyone. You too, Blue Jay. Yeah, everything that happened was triggered directly by just going to bed. The cutscenes happened all in a row. I was just trying to think, was there an opportunity where I could have ended off the episode earlier? Yeah, yeah I would have just had to not go to bed, which is always... Well, actually, it's not how I end. I usually go to bed and then do minigames. Anyway, yeah, don't get it started with Rixel. Monster epidemic. Belkir and Kieran are working non stop. I miss you, and I hope you're all safe. Oh, yeah, we got that thing. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, yeah, one, two, three, four. Yeah, we were up to six official tournament wins. Or, no, did Ziggy count? He's on the list, but I don't think he was an official match. Oh, <laughs> you don't just walk through the door. Look really cool in your uniforms. Mine feels a little tight. I might have to lose a few pounds. It feels strange to be wearing them before the closing ceremony. People have already asked us for help, like we're staff. Well, we really are in the brigade. They just haven't thrown us a party yet. I know we're supposed to be laying low, but have you guys discovered anything else? Not quite, but I did do some experiments after Belchior went to sleep last night. What? And here I always think of you as such a rule follower. A little time with the Blue Jays really corrupted you. <laughs> hey, I'm just passionate. Quite so. Can I do anything to help? Soon. I'll call you all together as quickly as possible. For now, the plan remains the same. Which means you've got a match against the final three to win. It's weird to say with everything else going on, but I'm really nervous about my match. I don't find it odd at all. I felt the same way before mine. Hey, don't sweat it. You're gonna be perfect. Exactly. You'll be joining us tomorrow, and hopefully by then I'll have more definitive data. Alright, I'll put all my energy into my match prep then. Wait, has Karen always had wings? Then it's the final three who should be nervous. We better head out. It's nearly time to report for our first official assignments. Bye. Hmm. Also, how close did I get to a 5x combo? Was I just like a couple moves too slow, or was I only on a 4x even if I got that? I feel like I was almost there last match. I might want to replace this item anyway though. Also, let's see, the promote sauces, they let me bring a level 2 gem to a level 3 gem twice. It does help you get any color you want, but I'd rather just have two level 3 gems straight up. So I believe we go back to the, to one of these. And blue. Choice is arbitrary. I guess, since I'm already splitting the episode, let's at least, like, look at the shop. I'm not going to do the minigames. Alright, we haven't gotten money, of course, so we can't, like, afford anything. Crystallizer oven. Slowly clones taste gems. It is another oven. It might be better for me than the stoic pan, because I barely use the stoic pan. 
course, in that case, I can't make a, one of the level 1 start ingredients into two immediate level 3 taste gems. Hmm. Still. I mean, it, I assume you can just, like, clone level 3s with this once you have level 3s. So I could move things over from the middle oven to the crystallizer oven. Hmm. Ooh, extends combo window. Is that worth an ingredient slot? Well, I call it an ingredient slot, but it's cooking slot. Maybe it's a good thing that I'm doing this before ending off so that I can think about it between episodes. Master Expertise, Noxious. Use 10 ingredients originally containing poison or bone. Hmm. Master Expertise, Speed. Serve a dish that was 50 points by one minute into the match. Uh. Isn't that just... You start with the Stoic Pan and... You put in a couple starters? I think we definitely need this book. <laughs> in which case, I guess I'm not using the crystallizer oven. Hmm. Yes, much to think about, but that will be it for this part. See ya!